Live at Stagecoach, John and Tammy in the morning with the great Trace Atkins. Awesome to see you again, ma'am. How well, is it? Uh, thank you. Oh, oh. Well, what happened? You were still here to you for Now you're all... I don't know, but then you said great. And that's like, that's laying it on a little thick. All right. You know, okay. With the slightly mediocre Trace Media, Atkins. There you go. Right. <laughs> is that better? I'm much more comfortable with that. Okay. So let's explain the history that you two crazy kids have. When you walked in, you looked at Tammy. Now you're smiling again. That's good. Thank you. Yeah, yeah. It's just me. Why don't you talk? Oh, well... <laughs> Just about, it'll be 10 years ago, I think, this fall. I think it was fall when we went, were on the Pyramid Game Show together. And Trace and I rocked it. Well, actually, you were an awesome partner mm -hmm. on Pyramid. You were awesome. And we got down into the circle, playing for $10,000, and we missed it by one category. Yeah. The category was things you find on a cave wall. And you were so good. I don't know if you remember this. You were like pictures of the big hunt. Excuse my imitation of you. Uh, <laughs> you were like, far, far, smoke. And I'm like, things you find inside a cave. And they wouldn't give it and to you. And they wouldn't give it to you. I know, that was, it was not cave right. Wall. I right. was impressed because when she told me that you, she didn't win, and then we had a viewing party, uh, I, I thought she was sandbagging me. I thought she, you guys, she was lying to me because you guys just cruised through everything. In fact, you passed on things in a cave wall one right to the top one, and the, the category was boring colors. And you mm -hmm. go, Beige. Yeah. She's, like, she's like boring colors. And you had like 35 yeah. seconds. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, we were good together. Yeah, we were good. We, we were, were good, good together, Trace. We were. We were. Ten years ago. We that, were. Was, that was before you were a big movie star, big TV star, a mediocre TV star, a mediocre movie star. <laughs> um, but I'll never forget that show, though, because when I saw Donnie Osmond, I don't know why I did this. But I put him in a headlock. Do you remember that? that? And that was after he had that I injury. put him in a headlock and I was like, Arr! and he was like, ah, screaming like a girl, you know. <laughs> and then I didn't know that he had had some kind of neck surgery. Yeah, huge <laughs> neck surgery, yes. And then like five minutes later, he had his neck brace on around his neck. Yeah. And I was just like, oh my you know God, what? I almost you killed almost Donnie. Killed you know what, That's why we didn't win the $10,000. Because yeah. you almost killed, you almost killed Donnie. Almost killed Donnie. Oh, that would have been a good story, though. <laughs> yeah, I'd be... Telling that every day. <laughs> San Quentin. Yeah, number six, three, seven, five, yeah. two, three. Right? So, tell us about the day you killed Donnie Osmond. <laughs> <laughs> Dude, not Donnie from Donnie Marie. I love them. That I'm so a little bit country. I'm a little bit rock and roll. I can't believe we're laughing at that. That's great. <laughs> that's, that's wrong. <laughs> Listen, what else? It's, it's only 130 before. outside, though. So. Are you going to wear black on stage? We're we'll worried about your hydration. Mm, I don't really know what okay. I'm going to wear. Yeah. Are you a guy that picks out outfits days before they go on? <laughs> Sorry, the stupidity of that question got to me before awesome. I was finished it. I was, I was waiting for the punch. Am I going to wear this t-shirt or that t-shirt? Listen, right. I'm glad you brought Lincoln Lawyer up because what's the chances of you and uh, McConaughey and doing like a, a buddy cop movie thing coming up? I think you guys would be great together. Probably not any chance at all. Really? I don't know. He stays really, really busy. He's doing, he's always got to doing something, you know. Did you I thought maybe they were going to do another one of those. Yeah. Lincoln Lawyer movies. Yeah. I guess not. Did you uh, party with him at all on, on, during the filming of that? No, but uh, I played guitar naked and he played bongos. Nice. See, perfect. See, I call that a party. It was fun. Seconds, but. See, if we just gave a little bit of that McConaughey ha ha with Trace's voice, it almost would be there. <laughs> Trace Seconds, it's great seeing you again. You Thanks for coming back to Stagecoach and, and get to San Diego when you can next time. All right. Please, all thank right. you for being such a good sport and playing with me. Thank you. Thanks for being here. All right. <laughs> Trace Jackson's live at Stagecoach from KSON.